right guys welcome back to african football this is our group c video with me is bum, mr bum, Mamba bum. In the, in, in, definitely with the sirens guys no we are hyped for group c i think group c no I, no 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 i actually like group b i think group b is where the fire will be group b is where the football will be so mr Mamba, we just need you to walk us through group c which is a group with the goat one Lionel messi is in this group hit us with the good news sir Oh, Group C seems like a variety of cultures. You've got a team from South America and Argentina. You've got Saudi Arabia playing with the Arabs in it. Marhaba to all the Arabs. You've got Mexico <laughs> playing in it. The, the Spanish-speaking guys from uh, North America. And you've got Poland playing in the group from mm -hmm. Europe. So we have four teams from four different regions in one group. So if you want mm -hmm. a pizza of football, different toppings and everything, this is mm -hmm. def definitely the group for you. So yeah, um, since for the previous two videos, I was going first. So in this video, we want you to have the first take. So give us a good news. Where do you feel Argentina will finish? All right, we're going to start. You forgot one thing. There's a Zambian in this group. Saudi Arabia's coach, Hevrena, is Zambian. He's like us. I know most of you are going to say it's French, but no. When he won us the Africa Cup in 2012, we gave him citizenship. citizenship. So Hevrena is a Zambian. He is him. And he's married and to his Zambian Kazi. wife. Yes, he's exactly married to his Zambian, Zambian wife. wife. So Hevrena is a Zambian. So on that notion alone, we have two Zambians there. Our coach, Janice Kazu, the guy, if you remember, who ended the game in 85 minutes, and every now these guys are top quality and representative so let me get into that argentina squad guys argentina is amazing and i'm speaking here um i used to be a ronaldo fan up until this morning when um he said so many bad things about my club <laughs> I, I i there's no player who's bigger than the club you should tell cr7 that first of all so they got Lionel messi but i generally believe this team is uh di maria's team Lionel messi is just playing in there. It's Di Maria's team. And currently, Lionel Messi has got past his prime and now the team doesn't play around him. 35 games unbeaten. I believe this is quite easy. This is the easiest selection I've made tonight. Argentina on top of the group. No questions asked. No problems here. Mr. Mwamba, hit us with the good news. Funny enough, I feel Argentina are a very good team, but I don't see them topping this group. They will qualify no. off the group, them being second, nothing controversial, here. nothing controversial here. But I see them being that team that they might even make the final. But Argentina is a team that usually starts tournaments slow. So maybe mm. in their first game or something, Rodrigo de Paul, mm. uh, Martinez, the Terra Martinez, um, mm. from Inter Milan, of course, and Martinez yeah, from Manchester United commonly known as Lika. Mm. I see all mm. these players trying to string together a few good passes here and there, but I don't mm. see them finishing first. I see them drawing one of these fine games. I don't know who they'll draw again. It's probably Mexico mm. or something, but I don't see Mexico. them finishing. Exactly. I don't see them finishing first. So I'm going with Argentina second. Oh, okay. Okay, this man likes to fight. This man wants to fight the whole country of Argentina. Okay, that's okay. That's fine by you, fam. So secondly, I'm going to move to Saudi Arabia, the country being coached by a Zambian, Ooh. a man of French origin, came to Zambia, made us win the Africa Cup, the first Africa Cup for my nation, guys. And now it's Saudi Arabia. All I'm going to say is, Hevrena, Haverena, or as you call him, Mr. Kung Fu energy and wildcat in Zambia. We call him wildcat. It's a popular <laughs> energy drink. They, those guys can sponsor us. Mr. Wildcat is a specialist at qualifying out of groups. He came to Zambia, got a bunch of Zambian farmers, and made them win an Africa Cup. Went to Ivory Coast, got them an Africa Cup. Went to Morocco, got them a Chan Trophy. This man is a specialist at the group stages. And for me, I don't see nothing but just him being second in this group. He's very good at getting draws. If you guys have never watched him play, I've watched him. He was at my national team. And for me, that is where Saudi Arabia is going to end in this group. Mr. Mwamba, hit us with the good news. Well, for me, Saudi Arabia, I, I don't see them winning any game in this group. You know, I look at the Saudi Arabia team. I know Haverina is a very good coach. He's probably one of the best tacticians we've seen 
in a long time. But then mm-hmm. Saudi Arabia just doesn't hit me as a footballing nation. So mm-hmm. I'm going dead last for Saudi Arabia. And I'm sorry to all the Arab fans, but Saudi Arabia needs to be dead last. Okay, that's um no guys. Have you seen Mr. Mwamba's of controversial takes? But guys, if you're enjoying this content, remember to like and subscribe. We're trying to get to eleven thousand subscribers by the end of before the start of the World Cup. So let's move on to Mexico. My favorite people, the time, the one time I don't okay. So I'm gonna say something that everyone probably is thinking about. Ochawa. Ochawa just appears at every World Cup and becomes the greatest keeper in the world. He becomes prime De Gea, prime Noya. Ochawa is like the greatest goalkeeper in the history of the World Cup. You know how they count Miroslav Klose as the best goal scorer of the World Cup? Ochawa is probably yep. the best keeper, best keeper of the World Cup. But unfortunately, Mexico isn't going anywhere anytime soon. That's what I'm going to say. We've seen them fail to beat the USA, they've gone three bow without beating the USA, which is L3 is very weird as a team sometimes. I'm like, you guys have got like some talent, but you just can't play football. So for me, Mexico <laughs> ending this group on number three. No questions asked. Ochawa, we love the guy, but number three, we're just gonna see him in the group stages, nothing else. Mr. Mwamba, go on. Um, funny enough, I'm also going for Mexico third. I, I love Ochawa as a goalkeeper, he is mm-hmm the best World Cup goalkeeper. There are no doubts mm-hmm. about that. But um, I see them moving forward with uh, Raul Jimenez here and there. Uh, they've got a few good players, mm-hmm. you know. They've got uh, Hector Herrera. Mm-hmm. But I don't see them finishing second or first. I just see them getting a few draws here and there, making life difficult mm-hmm. for other teams in the group. But I don't see them finishing above third. So Mexico third. Mm-hmm. They would have been dead last if Saudi Arabia didn't exist. So Mexico third. All right. No, no, that's fine. That's fine by you. That's your opinion. And that's a good part about videos. We have people with opinions. So now we're going to move exactly. on to Poland. As as is it what what is the artist said? He took a walk in Poland. And we're gonna sing the whole song. It's a very it's a <laughs> it's a prime song right now. Everyone is listening to it. Oh, it's, it's yeah, Liu Yachi did a song. You guys should definitely check it out. But yeah, Poland. Um they're relying on an old striker who who is a, who wants to be a social media influencer by the name of um uh, Robert Lewandowski. He plays for Barcelona and um uh, yeah, he's okay. He's an okay guy. But football isn't all goals. It needs some defense and I think Poland doesn't have that defensive shape locked down. And I've seen a couple of their games. I've seen them in the Nations League Cup. Definitely Poland has not been impressive. For me, they are finishing dead last in this group. Mr. Mwamba, your call. Take your, take your peek. Defend All right, your so decision. Lo- looking at Lewandowski, he's arguably been the best player in the world for the past three years. I know the Ballon d'Or went to Benzema. Mm-hmm. Everyone doesn't I didn't regard Lewandowski. He still had more goals mm-hmm. than Benzema last season. Mm-hmm. Looking at that Polish team, they have Zelensky in the team. They have the mm-hmm. likes of Milik in the team. All are performing well currently in, in the Italian yeah. league. And you talked mm-hmm. about that defense being trash. They have actually mm-hmm. got players from the Premier League that will mm-hmm. play in that defense. The likes of Mati Cash from Aston Villa changed nationality mm-hmm. from being English to joining the Polish mm-hmm. team. And That's many cool. more other players are changing their nationality to join that defense, mm-hmm. the likes of Bleak. So I'm looking at this Polish team, looking at how mm-hmm. solid their defense will be. When I look mm-hmm. at the midfield, the likes of Zelensky, uh, the all pull strings in that midfield. So mm-hmm. I look at this team, I look at Milik, I look at everyone in this team. I officially see Poland finishing first in their group. And for the first time in World Cup history, Poland will make a quarterfinal. Oh, okay. Bold prediction um, right there. Yep, yeah, this is a very bold prediction. Uh, Mr. Mwamba has gone against the likes of Mexico with some experience. He says they're going nowhere. I went with Saudi Arabia. I believed in the guys. I believe in Hebrina. And coach, we still love you back here in Zambia. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, remember to like and subscribe. We're trying to get to 11,000 subscribers. You guys could be doing us a big service. Mr. Mwamba, anything else for the fans? Um, for the fans, just 
subscribe to us African football keep following our content just make sure you follow us during this whole period of the world cup we do everything football African football so please subscribe if you're just looking for a page where even before you go to sleep you listen to proper analysis check out African football subscribe to African football and don't forget to like all right, guys, so we have group A, group B already done. This is our group C video. But if you want to watch our group D video, just click the link up here. If you want to watch our group A or group B videos, they'll be in the down there in the in the in the description. So remember to like and subscribe and see you in the next one. Peace out, guys. Peace.